Hey guys, it's Jacqueline and for today's video I wanted to do another art vlog. I haven't done one of these in a little while. Um, I've been busy working on all sorts of projects um, as usual. I feel like that's normally what I do. Um, but for today I wanted to do um, just take you along with a couple of the different paintings that I've been doing. Um, there's a lot of ones that I've done off camera. Um, I've been posting them on my Instagram. I just started posting again, um, posting every day. So if you guys want to go check that out, link in the description box below. I would really appreciate it. But you know, if you don't want to, that's totally cool too. Anyways, so for this first painting, um, just before this, it had been super snowy and like just freezing cold. Um, I live in Alberta, Canada, and so most of the time it's cold, but like there was a real cold snap. So I was feeling like having um, some summer vibes, I don't know, something besides just ice. So I wanted to paint a garden type scene. Um, I was also inspired because I recently got some really pretty flowers um, from some clients. I got the ones that I was showing you earlier um, in this video and then also a client dropped off a dozen roses for me. So that was really sweet. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to paint something flowery, gardeny, so I decided to go with a secret garden. For Christmas, I got this really cool book from my friend Abigail. She was so sweet to buy it for me. Um, it's 500 drawing prompts. It is so cool, like just very different, weird drawings that I would never normally do. Um, I'm, I like more of this kind of Know, like scenery art or like animals or people cartoon lots of different styles but i definitely would never ever ever think to draw something i don't know just very i guess they kind of do some drawings like um i don't even know what it's called like sci-fi type things and just very like anybody could like this like you could do so many different things i don't know I don't really know what I'm saying, but it's really cool. I've really been enjoying it. So um, most of the time I've just been drawing in it, but this time I've decided to do a painting um, just because I feel like something like a garden, any sort of scenery is just so much prettier in a painting form. So that's what I ended up going with. It's just a super chill, very simple painting that I did. Um, I don't know, I, I love doing this in the evenings after coming home from work. It's just, there's something so relaxing about um, just coming and I don't know, doing a painting. I just, I've been loving it. So that's what I've been kind of filming for you guys lately. Like I said, it's been super cold and wintry. I mean, it's January, February in Canada, so that makes sense. But I, um, I decided to start a project that I normally wouldn't do, um, but I've been wanting to do for a super long time. Um, I have a huge interest in like history, but specifically family history. Um, and so I started working on making my own family tree. So that's been taking me away from doing some art, um, but I'm okay with that. It's all good. Um, so I've been doing it through Ancestry, obviously not sponsored. Don't have enough viewers for that, but that'd be so cool. Anyways, I've been loving it. Um, and so it kind of led me down some rabbit trails of getting other art, um, or not art, but um, just finding other things about family history and stuff. Um, and one of the cool things is my grandma actually ended up giving me this really pretty tea set that's very Dutch um, kind of vibes to it. Um, 
and uh, anyways I picked it up when I was little and she finally gave it to me so I'm just packaging it up right now for when I eventually have my own place um, because I still don't yet and I'll use it then um, but this anyways this like inspired me to make this next piece I've been trying to learn how to use colored pencils properly um, because I've never done it before. This was my first drawing with trying some of the different techniques. Definitely don't like how it turned out, but I still enjoy doing it. Um, so there's a lot of Scottish, um, well not a lot, but there's some Scottish in me and then as well as mostly German and Dutch um, from my grandparents and then their parents. Um, so it's pretty close that we came over to Canada. Um, more recently not hundreds of years ago um, and so it's been pretty cool to look at some of the history in it so I wanted to do something that kind of represented um, I don't know just just a different culture and so I decided to do this piece um, I definitely want to do something like this in painting form I think that'd be kind of cool um, but that'll be for the future so and then some other things I've just been working on. I have just some of these random little pictures that I've drawn, painted, whatever, um, throughout Christmas and some of this winter. Um, so I'm just putting it into my scrapbook. So I'm doing that one that I just completed and then as well as a couple other pieces. I've been trying to do a lot of different mixed media, um, which has been really interesting to learn how to do. Um, so yeah, if you guys wanna, like I said, check out my Instagram. I have been posting on there, so. Um, that's where you can check out my art, but uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and have a great rest of your day. Okay, bye.